Hey guys, and today this is Will J, and I'm going to teach you guys how to fish on Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. So, first, obviously, you go up to the water's edge. Now, I have it selected, but you have to go to your bag and go to the key items pocket. But I have it selected, so I can just press Y, that button. And to select something, you just click on it and press register. And then it'll automatically register for you. Now I'm just going to fish until something bites. Hopefully it won't take long. Not even a nibble. Ready? Just be patient with me. I'll catch something eventually. It's ridiculous how long this thing takes. I hate that you can't just fish and they'll automatically give it to you. It's stupid. And the battle that ensues is pretty much the same as the, all the others. Finally. And I'm sorry for all the crappy, um, you know, graphics. Well, the crappy viewing on this um, iPod. Basically, it's the same. Just uh, wear your opponent down. Oh yeah, by the way, I got a new... And Magikarp, by the way, are the worst Pokemon. They only know Splash, but they evolve into Gyarados, so it's worth it. So this actually might take a long while. So, just... Yeah, I know, I wasn't too excited about doing this episode either, because I knew I'd get a magic card. Oh yay, critical hit, this might not actually take that long. No. I'm going to catch it, which is basically the same. The only difference is you get to fish, which takes forever. But, you get Pokemon from it. Not necessarily good, but they'll work. And that is how you fish to catch Pokemon.